Good morning. Remember the first time Arthur brought you to see me? He was so tiny, with those big green eyes. Enjoy perfecting your craft, honeybee, but mind that you don't forget about your regular life. Enjoy time with your friends. Maybe find someone special. There's magic mm -hmm. in the little things, too. Как шлюз. Glückwunsch, nice. Ebene 3. Glückwunsch, du hast Z für diese Ebene. Hmm. 
Thomas, I'm settling into life on the farm. Lena has been very encouraging. Huh. Known Lena a long time. She's very kind hearted. Evil. So you used to live in a really cool city and chose to move here? Like, on purpose? Okay... Ah. Mit Grillen, denkt man. Angus keeps wanting me to be his guinea pig for his more inventive pastry creations. But not all baked goods are worth the calories, to be brutally honest. Watch out, little fish. My son's looking for volunteers for his re-election campaign. And you're green enough to not know better. Hello. Come and see me if you're not, yes? Yeah. Bye. Bruno 
was cool. He gets my love of the ocean, but by the end of the day, his stall gets pretty ripe, no lie. <laughs> to think about Cameron. There's something about his talk about malcontents that sets me on edge. Angus really seems to like going to the consciousness center, though. He's always inviting me to come. <coughs> when I grew up, I hope I can braid my hair like my mom. Do you know her? Yes, I know Lena. She tries. My mom just has this way of making... This design is fabulous. You really uh -huh. think so, Sophia? Absolutely. In fact, I want to commission one of these dresses in my size. <laughs> what do you think, Tara? It's such a nice design. It will look great on you, Sophia. It certainly will. And I'll make sure it fits like a dream. Can I tell you a secret? The design was inspired by a vintage dress that belonged to my mom. Oh, yes, I think I remember the one you're talking about. Gloria always looks so classic in it. I can't wear the real one. That's like admitting my mom's never coming back. But this design is my way of paying tribute. I think that's a lovely idea, Violet. I just need to get around to fixing my old sewing machine so I can actually make these. <laughs> friend in around that. Violet, did you grow up here? Yes. My dad used to be mayor, actually. Before Mayor Soft. Oh, I guess Otto's not your favorite person, then. No, it wasn't even his fault. My dad withdrew his re-election bid before the first debate. Otto just coasted to an easy victory. I hope they run someone stronger against him this time. Cameron's a looker, isn't he? He hasn't been here much longer than you, but I wouldn't be surprised if he has admirers already. That consciousness mm. center of his, though. Mm. Ah, I don't know about that place. to keep me from reaching the pinnacle. Go, with logic in your minds and your eyes on the path. I love spring. Wouldn't it be nice if it could be spring all year round? Swinging the hammer is a great way to get out frustrations from your past. Luckily for me, my past is littered with worthless ex-boyfriends. You visited the local <clears throat> drinking establishment, I hear? You mean the bar? I care about supporting small businesses, but I was hoping this particular small business would close when Damon's parents went back to South Africa. It seems like he really loves the bar, though. Yes, he does. For some reason. Have you seen that old silver willow tree in the woods? I would really love a sample of the wood, but I know better than to take a saw to it. Every now and then I pass by hoping I'll get lucky and it will drop a branch. Ideally, something delicious.
Otto offered to move the graveyard when I first moved in. Ew, really? He said he didn't want my members to be put off by the constant reminder of their mortality. In truth, I think it's hard for him to pass it each day on his way to the mayor's mansion. But I think life's brevity is what gives us our purpose. We must seize every moment. It's oh. a shame Hazel gave up raising chickens. I miss having those farm fresh eggs every morning. Yo, you are biting. Parker keeps offering to build me a house in town. I know he's just trying to be kind, but I like being out here with my little woodland friends. They're plenty good company. Mother never approved of the masks outside of rituals. She wasn't really the shrinking violet type. And I suspect you're not either, are you? Grandma said we should come out of hiding. Maybe she was right. They're not ready for that. And we're not either. The time will come. Ja, das denke ich. Witchcraft can make any task easier. It can make the lives of those around you easier. You must keep working at it, but don't ignore the rest of your life. It is a balance. smell just right. Here, you keep them. They're super useful for someone running a farm. Room more anytime you have the ingredients handy. Now go ahead. Let the High Priestess know you've finished your potion training. It took me ages to get this far in the coven. But don't give up. You'll get the hang of it. Well done, Initiate. You have mastered the art of herbology very quickly. 
The acolyte tells me she couldn't have done better herself. To recognize your skills and achievement, you may cast away your initiate designation. Yay! I really prefer to be called by my... You will be known as Novice from this point on. Right. I see. <coughs> right. Rest now and find ways to use your new craft. There will be more work to do before long. Bro, I brought something to come and I've got it up to sleep. In the trunk. Up to sleep. Ah, novice. It will soon be time for the turning of the seasons. Great. I love summer. Picnics, lemonade, going to the beach. But first, we must gather the ingredients <laughs> for our ritual. I'm Ready for sorry, the but doesn't the change from spring to summer just happen? You have much to learn. You'll find this island to be different in ways big and small. Gather the items and brew this potion, then we can begin. Oof. Summer coming. Oh, I know. Dann ist sie da im Kessel gebraut. Geist. My sister yet? Purple hair, sells flowers, acts like she's the boss of me when she's so... <clears throat> mm, I'm sleepy. 